Hey, well, I've been exploring the long ball exhibit that's opening today here at the Reds Hall of Fame and Museum. Now I'm here with its executive director, Rick Walls. First of all, thanks for being here. Uh, thanks for coming down to the long ball. Yeah, so let's talk about what we're looking at here at this case. You know, we've kind of gone through Red's history here, but this kind of explores more recent history, right? Yeah, a little mix of the, the old, the new, and some of the players that people recognize, like Will Benson. This is a jersey he wore when he had his debut. Really, it was just one of those moments. If you remember his first home run, how exciting that was. Yeah. And, and we showcase that in the audiovisual here in the exhibit as well. But Joey Votto's jersey, he wore this on a Mother's Day it was a rain delay, hit three home runs in the game and a walk-off grand slam. Real special day. Jay Bruce, a walk-off home run, uh, obviously to clinch the 2010 division championship and several other items you're going to find were like home plate that we dug up after Scooter Jeanette hit four home runs in wow. one game, being the only player in Reds history ever to do that. So from baseballs to bats to jerseys, the past and the present truly come together. I love that. And, and what is the importance of not only exploring Red's, you know, very past history, but also its recent history? Well, I think the, the younger audience needs to know about the past to kind of know what we've gone through to what we're trying to accomplish right now. So when you can bring a group in here and talk about Ellie De La Cruz or Jay Bruce or Joey Votto, we can share with them the stories of Johnny Bench and George yeah. Foster and Ted Klazuski and Veda Pinson. The story goes on and on and on. So it's a long and fun story, you know, about baseball. And really it tells a lot about this community. So come down and visit the long ball. Rick, thanks so much. Thank you. Yeah. We're going to explore a little bit more of this museum, so I'm going to send it back to you guys in the studio. You can always find our stories here on YouTube, but go ahead and click subscribe to get notifications and stay in the know.